Hang on, there's a vault. Stupid bitch, what do you know about such things, eh? Drop what? dead. Or maybe about 80 years, maybe. <laughs> what are you gaping at? All right, Leon? Yeah, okay, so far. I've... Yeah, sure. Ooh. Uh, can I get you a beer? Yeah, half. Half a beer. Bum and half a beer. She's beautiful. Yeah, she's beautiful. I'll have double scotch, thank I you. Don't you want a gin then? No, I've changed my mind. Are you sure? Yes, I'm sure. Hello, please. I want to report that I've just seen some blokes breaking into a building at the back of Lombard Street. Lombard Street. Yeah, I think it's the bank. The Metropolitan Bank. Yes, yes, thank you. I've got that. This is R4 to HQ1. R4 to HQ1. And proceeding to Metropolitan Bank, Lombard Street. Anonymous call of attempted break-in. Listen. You hear that? Metropolitan Bank, Lombard Street, miles away. Well, how about that, then? Male informant, anonymous. A good friend Bird is giving the squad a little exercise tonight. Pull down a club then, Humpy boy. That's a smashing idea. Well, she's got time, isn't it? Yeah, she's a smashing dancer, you know. Yeah, can you dance? She's yeah. the greatest. Well, there's some time. Do you mind, sir? That's somebody else's order. Oh, that's a crime? She ain't done. Yeah, well, it's a double. Oh, well, she's time. been on for 20 minutes already. Hey, wait a minute. How about some service then? Certainly, Mr. Hoyle. Tell me something. Do you always let that cow gab like that? All right, Mr. Hoyle, I'll get her off the phone in a minute. You do that! Yeah. What? You want to get me done over? Crap. Who's who's crazy? Some drunk wanted to know if he could buy that new Bentley out front. Sounds like a bloke's come in the money, then. Eh? <laughs> yeah, think how I'll be getting along, Mr. Hoyle. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, well, that's it, then, lads, then. Oh. <laughs> now, don't you fly away too far, little black bird. I'll look after it, Bertie. Look after it, will you? <laughs> yeah. Come on, will you? Come. Look, if you don't want to go, I can think of a good reason why I could stay. Yeah. <laughs> come on, then, darling. Come on, Henry. Come on. Come on. Stop shoving. I've been pushing around enough today. Good, I'm in the mood.
Oh. <laughs> it's only old double guts Ruskin, stewed as usual. A receipt for 135 grand, boy. Enough for a whole fleet of bed, please. Yeah, and a third in each one. Who was the drunk? Nobody special. He's got eyes and a tongue, hasn't he? There's only old double guts Ruskin. Paralytic. Ruskin? Maybe he'll tell me why he ran away like a scalded cat after you left. Well, I booted him, didn't I? He may be looking for a telephone. Or another drink. Shorty, go and get him. Why me? Mr. Hall's not going to want any loose ends, is he? Go and find him. Go on. Jono? Um, Mrs. Jonas, can I help you? I'm sorry, ma'am. I'm afraid I'm drunk. Yes, sorry. Listen, I, I must speak to Mr. Jono. He's not here. I've just seen Lonigan and Anne is lost. Look, uh, hold on, I'll, I get a pencil. Paralytic drunk. Ruskin was in the pub tonight. He's just seen you lot coming in here. What happens when he reads about this in tomorrow's papers? What are you so worried about? You don't keep the guilt. No, but I can't have that count. Yes? It's OK. I found him. Yeah, in this telephone box. Passed out cold. Did he talk to anyone? No, I don't know whether he phoned anyone, but the receiver was off his hook. Where is he? Where is he? Oh, I'm standing on him. <laughs> You stupid idiot. Yeah, OK, OK. Look, put him in that car. Take him to your drum in Essex. Hey, hey, wait a minute. How do you know about my drum in Essex? Never you mind. You get in there. And you lot can get going, too. Who are you ordering about? You're Mr. Nobody's been on the floor. Brown, <laughs> boy. Calling a cab to take him home. Well, the law may be on the way now. <laughs> you losing your nerve? Well, use your loaf. The fellow's been on the floor. He could have snouted on us. These are new notes. We can't shift them. Yeah, well, no. I'll tell you what, I'll, uh, I'll see Mr. Hoy, but these lot can't stay here. Look, now, you hold up at Harmy's place. Hold up with Harmy until I come for you. Now, I'll fix it for you. Now, don't worry. You know what it is, don't you? Come on, lad. Come on, lad. Come on. Now, don't worry. I'll, uh, I'll look after you. 